We I lied! There's a pocket in the shirt that works! Hey everyone, welcome back to my world where no matter how old you get, you never need to grow up, you never need to stop collecting dolls, loving dolls, playing with dolls, dressing your dolls, doing whatever, or toys, or whatever it is you collect. There is no age limit. There is no age limit at which wearing a Monster High t-shirt is like, no, I'm sorry, you can't do that anymore. Are you 42? I'm sorry, 42. Well, you're cut off for the Monster High t-shirts. I'm sorry, you can't. No, nobody does that. And if they do, mm -hmm, finger gestures. I mean, <laughs> so by the way, in case you didn't see the other video where I explained this, someone uh, private messaged me on Instagram and let me know that Hot Topic is now carrying Monster High t-shirts again. <gasps> so yeah, I went out. It's been so long since I've had like an official new Monster High t-shirt. I'm so excited. I like the whole logo and stuff. And now it's like, well, and now I need Monster High dolls to review. But of course we don't have them, even though it's Q4 and we were supposed to get three collector's dolls, the original dolls. And I also, I couldn't get Greta because I was at a doctor's appointment with my son and Greta sold out in five minutes. So there is no Greta for me. And no, I'm not going on eBay and spending $300 on a Greta. Sorry, not happening. Now, what I am going to talk about today is not Monster High, it's Barbie Extra. Now, the previous Barbie Extra video, it had me a little perplexed. Well, not the video, the dolls. But these two, which by the way, I would like to say huge thanks to Mattel for sending me these two Barbie Extra dolls for free. Now, technically, I had already purchased this one for myself, but they sent one to me. So I feel like I need to tell you. I don't know if this is one I purchased or it's the one that Mattel sent me, so I'm just going to say thank you. This one, absolutely, they sent to me. And uh, this is number 13. So I think this is the highest number thus far. So this would be the newest. And this is number nine right here. Okay. Now, I do have number 10. I found her. And I have whatever. She doesn't have a number. She's a special edition doll that I've had in a box full of Barbie stuff that I was going to make videos about. And that's where number uh, 10 was. Okay. But I'm not doing those two yet. I'm just going to do these two. I have got so many Barbie dolls. Gener just generally speaking right now, like you cannot see on the floor around me, is just boxes of dolls. I've got a ton of Barbie dolls. I've got um, two of the uh, Rainbow High Sleepover dolls. I still can't find Marissa. I've got one more Rockstar doll to open. I've got, um, I've got the Na 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 family boxes with the three, have you seen the three pack? And I, I bought a Mermaid High doll so we could see what that's all about. The irony, I can't show you the front of this mug because it's covered in lipstick. The irony of this mug today that I grabbed it out of the cabinet is that it says, if it requires pants or a bra, it isn't happening today. I'll have you know I'm wearing both. You can't tell, but I am. All right, so Barbie Extra is like the kind of fashion forward line of Barbie. And I really like them. Like at first I was a little, eh, and then there's been a few that have been complete duds for me. I've been real honest about that in some videos, like in the videos I just did. Um, and then there's been some where I've just been like, wow, I really love that doll. So I'm really excited about this. I don't think they're gonna make BMR dolls anymore. Um, I don't think they sold particularly well. Um, and you know, they were spent, those were for the collectors. Um, and in general, like Barbie collectors been a little, a little less than, uh, oh, the last year or so. Like I did get, and she's over here somewhere. Um, there was a new, they're doing a gem series and the first one came out and I think she's Amethyst. And um, I got her and we will do a video about her um, eventually. Uh, but I'm just like, did I really pay $100 or whatever I paid for that doll? God, if I paid $100 for that doll. I mean, it's just, so, you know, they need to work on the collector series. I pre-ordered the Merman, um, but I just, I don't know. I'm gonna get the rest of them out of the box, but already, like I'm gonna get them all the way out of the box, but already, I love her. I'm emotionally attached already. I'll be back in one second with them out of the box so we can take a closer look. Okay, let's start with this girl that we have out of the box. Now I have got to tell you that she comes with the cutest pet. 
Oh my gosh. So she's got this little like chihuahua looking dog. Wait, let me get you, let me get your glasses on. I think you're a chihuahua or you might be a gerbil. I'm not really sure. I'm, oh, come on. I'm bad with the pet. What do you think? It's a chihuahua, right? That's a chihuahua. And, um, or a really chubby hamster. But I think it's a chihuahua standing on its back feet. I cannot get its glasses back on. Oh, come on. You're so cute when your glasses are on. You look so intelligent. Here we go. Just stay on. Just for a Okay, how cute is he? All right, are she? Now, it also comes with this, like, what looks like a donut or a floaty, but the hamster fits in it. Or the chihuahua. Get your glasses on. There you go. Okay, that's so cute, right? Isn't that cute? I think it's cute. I don't know. What has it got to do with this doll? Okay, here's what I have figured out. Here's what's going on now with Barbie Extra. So they are over at the Mattel offices. This is what they're doing, okay? They are just grabbing stuff and putting it together and putting it with their Barbie Extra dolls. So they had... Um, they're like, oh, we have like a donut floaty. Wait, wait, we have a chihuahua dog for something else. Let's throw some glasses on it. Yay. What has it got to do with this doll who plays basketball? Nothing. Okay. Just checking. So this doll has a, a basketball purse that says let's play on it. And she is wearing kind of a uh, quote unquote boyfriend shirt. Okay. Um, her hair is just mashy mashy. She's got these sunglasses, which, okay, she's gorgeous. Look at her. She's gorgeous. I love her face. Love this sculpt. Um, I really like this, this, the way that they did her hair. Like, I like the way the front looks. We can pretend the back isn't happening. Um, but I do like the way that, that the front looks. Now, this jacket really doesn't work for me, but if you want to see the whole shrabang, here we go. So it's a super oversized shirt uh, slash jacket. Um, is there an actual pocket there? No, 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 this is not, it's not MG. Oh, wait, wait, I lied! There's a pocket in the shirt that works! Oh my gosh! Oh, <gasps> mm. makes me like this shirt so much more. But this shirt on like this outfit makes no sense whatsoever. So we're going to take off the basketball purse. Um, cause I do not intend to display her with the basketball purse or this jacket. Cause what she's wearing under the jacket. Look, Oh, there's tissue. Oh no, there's not, it's not tissue. It's plastic. All right. This is interesting. <laughs> the behind the scenes. What's underneath? Um, what lies beneath the jacket is plastic probably to keep something from staining the doll so i thought that was weird when i was moving around i kept hearing this crinkling sound i was like what is that all right here we go let me try to get this stuff off of you which is rubber banded to her hi okay um all right okay let's oh yeah okay so i can see that there's some paint transfer onto the rubber band. So they probably did that to protect the blue jacket from this thing, which is a super cool take on a basketball jersey. Isn't it? Got these things here. Um, and then this ridiculously big necklace, which is very cool. I really like this. I love the two tone, like the pink and the red. I don't, don't, I do not hate it. it says Malibu 59, of course. And then underneath it, she's just got black, uh, black stretchy shorts on, like almost like bike shorts. I kind of wish they were a color, but I guess black works best with this. And then to tie it all together, she's wearing work boots because I mean, why would she wear cool sneakers with this? Okay, so that's her. Now, to further prove that they are just throwing stuff together, okay, we have this one, who I was, like, kind of excited about. <laughs> like, what was that? <laughs> Your voice just went up like 20 octaves. I know, really have to shave my head. Speaking of shaved heads, um, 
So one side of her hair is shaved, but they didn't flock it. It's just, bald. and that's fine. That's fine. And then she's got these um, barrettes, right? All the hair is over to one size and she's got side and she's got the barrettes. I, I know that's a style thing. I like it. These glasses have nothing to do with anything. These are stars. This is, they were just like, uh, we've got star sunglasses. Throw it in with that one. Okay. Then um, this was somewhere on the floor and someone said, you know what? If you put that over this dress, it just makes it like haute couture, high fashion, super like it's so fashionable, you don't understand it fashion. And here's the thing, I kind of agree. I thought I hated this with this dress, but I don't. What does that mean? What is going on with me? Is Barbie extra starting to make sense to me? What makes no sense to me is she just has a piano purse. Like they were like, oh, do we have a piano purse? Throw it out over the rainbow chair with the rainbow thing and the fluffy blue thing. Okay, yeah, that'll work. And then, and then, by the way, her, sh her, her dress is awesome. It says shine bright like the stars. This jacket right now is still sewn onto her dress. I, I think I'm actually going to keep her in this jacket and display her in this jacket. You're like, no way. Yeah, I mean, at first I thought I wasn't, but then I was like, you know what? So I'm actually kind of liking this doll. Oh, by the way, she's got sneakers on. She's got platform sneakers. We might be doing a swippy swappy with the, with the shoes. But, okay, now let's look at the accessories. Now remember, these are for kids, okay? This is a, it's a play line doll. I don't want to say these are for kids. These are a play line doll, okay? So they're not, they're not for the collectors, although us collectors are collecting them. Okay, trying to get her to stand. Now, these are my stands again. These are not. Okay, so these are the accessories that came with this doll. And I didn't even, I didn't even bother to get them out of the plastic because I was like, what does this have to do with anything? Now, I know, like, apparently dolls with pets sell better than dolls without pets. It does not seem to matter, at least according to the folks at Mattel, what the heck the pet is, how it relates to, I can't get this out, how it relates to the, the, uh, the, the, the doll in question or anything, because her pet is, her pet is a crocodile or alligator. Um, I'm not sure what kind of water it swims in with, with a grill that says, Oh no, it doesn't say we. <laughs> it says sweet. I was like, why does it say we? <laughs> Here you go. So it's hard to see, but that's an S. Then you've got your W-E-E, -E -E, which was very obvious. And then this is a T. So it's sweet. So the grill says sweet. So we've got an alligator with a grill that says sweet. Wait, wait, wait. One of these lollipops. And this jewelry. Because obviously that all goes with this. <laughs> now, this is adorable. And it's not that I don't like wee crocodiles. I just don't understand what the selection process was. I mean, okay, so he says sweet and then he has a lollipop. Are we to infer that the lollipop is for him? Is it for her? And then she just gets this ugly jewelry and I think that goes on the crocodile. I don't know. I don't know, but these are the two of the newer Barbie extra dolls uh, that continue to perplex me. Uh, but I really, really, I actually like these two. Um, as much as I'm making fun of them, I think they're both really beautiful. I don't think I showed you guys her face. I think I was so like hyped up on the hair and everything. Her face is really sweet. I like that mold. Um, I think they're both really, really good looking Barbies. I think they're fun. I mean, I'm definitely keeping them in my Barbie extra collection. Um, I, I, 
I think I had to keep him just and call him Wee Crocodile now. <laughs> It's just so funny to me. Um, but I will link you to uh, down below to a page uh, where it has all the Barbie extras that are available on amazon.com. If you do buy anything from that uh, page, I will get a little commission. Thank you so much. I appreciate it because it helps me to buy more dolls. Thank you again to Mattel for sending me these dolls for free, even though I also bought one of these myself too. Um, but I'll donate one and keep one. Uh, so thank you guys so much for watching. Let's talk about pets and dolls and accessories in the comments, shall we? I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching. Bye.